Ethan Klotfelter. I'm now an associate professor uh, here in the biology department at Amherst. I've been here since uh, 2003, and I've been working here in the bird sanctuary since uh, 2005. We installed about 150 uh, bird boxes here in, in 2004 and have been monitoring them for the past four years or so. We usually have a group of students, maybe uh, between two and five students each year who work on projects out here. Hi, I'm Jeff Giller. Uh, I'm a rising junior and I'm here this summer with the Hughes Fellowship. I'm Erin and I'm going to be a senior and I'm writing my thesis on tree swallows in the bird sanctuary. I'm Gabby. I'm going to be a junior this coming fall. Um, I really love being out in the bird sanctuary because um, it's always, it's like I really love doing fields research and I love being able to like be outside and feel like I'm actually like making like just like actually doing something and I, I think it's really incredible like like watching the birds grow and develop I think it's just like also Amherst is just beautiful so <laughs> I'm just so happy to be out here. So now we're at the point where we're weighing and measuring lots of baby birds we're trying to um, understand how much of the uh, of the health of young birds is a function of genetics and how much of it is a function of uh, environment and so we have been doing an experiment in which we've been swapping babies from one nest to another and then looking at st uh, several measures of their health as a function of their size and so today we'll be taking blood from birds and we'll be using that blood later on to do a few physiological assays and then also just measuring size and weight and uh, so these are birds that are about two weeks old and have about a week left until they leave the nest. But this is really the last day that we can um, safely open up the boxes without the birds trying to fly away from us.